Thank you, Lieutenant Governor. He said it, so I really should just carry on. Good morning, everybody, and thanks for joining us today. I want to begin by congratulating John Kerry on his confirmation and thanking him for his service to the people of the Commonwealth. For more than 25 years as a veteran, as a prosecutor, Lieutenant Governor, and United States Senator, he has been a voice and a vote for progressive pragmatism and a model of statesmanship. We are so very fortunate that our country will have, have a person of such character and integrity as our next Secretary of State. We wish him well in this critical new work role, and I thank him personally for his friendship. Yesterday afternoon, I received uh, Senator Kerry's letter resigning his Senate seat. Under Massachusetts law, I now have the responsibility to set a date for a special election to fill the vacancy and to appoint someone to serve as senator in the interim. Over the weekend, after communications between my staff and Secretary Galvin, we set, as you know, June 25th as the date for the special election. Today, I have the great honor, privilege, and personal pleasure to appoint Mo Cowan as United States Senator in the interim until that special election. Mo Cowan has been a trusted advisor, professional friend, and colleague for a very, excuse me, professional colleague, strike that, uh, and friend for a very long time. He served this administration as both uh, chief of staff and chief legal counsel. He came to public service from the Boston law firm of Mince Levin, where he was a partner in the business litigation practice. He is a native of North Carolina and a graduate of Duke University, and came to Massachusetts 22 years ago to attend Northeastern Law School, from which he graduated with his law degree in 1994, and which he now serves as a trustee. Mo is a highly respected public citizen. He, his service on the front lines in our efforts to manage through the worst economy in 80 years and build a better and stronger commonwealth for the next generation has given him an intimate understanding of the issues we face. In every step, he has, pro he has brought preparation, perspective, wisdom, sound judgment, and clarity of purpose. And it was a private fact, now known publicly thanks to the Lieutenant Governor, that he also brought cool. <laughs> that has all earned him the respect, admiration, and trust of people throughout government, the business community, labor, and advocacy groups. He has been a valued ally to me and to our work on behalf of the people of the Commonwealth, and I am confident that he will be to his new colleagues in the United States Senate and to the President as well. On a personal note, I want to thank Mo for his willingness to take on this assignment and his wife Stacy and the boys for letting him do so. I know the personal sacrifice that goes with public service and I appreciate that your own sense of service is behind your willingness to lend Mo to the people of the Commonwealth a little while longer. And with that, it's now my honor to present to you uh, the United States Senator-designate for Massachusetts, Mo Cowan.